Hello everybody, today on JM and Friends, a rare piece of consumer advice. Here behind me we have an Aston Martin DB9, specifically the world famous Dad B9, which belongs to my good friend Ben from the channel Dad Cars. Now the thing about the DB9, much like the Jaguar XK and the Porsche 911, is that this is a 2 plus 2, which every time I've featured one on the channel, I've said that means it's a two-seater. The two in the back essentially are for display purposes, or if you're like Ben, for the use of very small children only. However, I figured it was probably worth double checking that I haven't been terribly misleading all of you over the last few years. And as this channel is called JM and Friends, I thought I'd enlist the help of a few friends just to check whether you can or cannot actually get four fully grown adults in this car. And this is the point in time where I really, really would like all of my friends to be jockeys. Unfortunately, they are not. So, allow me to introduce the cast for today. We have, first up, the man himself, Ben from Dad Cars, in the blue shorts and standing in, come, 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 quick, 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 quick. It's like the Miami Grand Prix all over again, isn't it? Okay, and you are how tall? 5'11"? Five, 5'11". Five, yeah. Okay, so then next up we have Mr. Anthony Marcana himself of JM and Friends and also Sports and Touring standing in it. We're going to call it 5'10", more or less level with myself. And then, just to make our lives needlessly difficult, we have Anthony's son, Damani, standing proud at 6'2", with a tailwind. Enjoy. Right, we've drawn straws and then I've thrown them away because I've decided that this is not a democracy, it's a dictatorship. I am going to go in the driver's seat. Ben has volunteered to go behind me. Uh, Anthony, as next most responsible adult, is going to go in the front. And uh, Damani, as the youngest, uh, he's going in the back as well. Wish us luck. I'll be honest, this is not the dad car that I would have uh, had in mind for a kid of this size. <laughs> yeah, when you, when you said you were bringing your son, I, I imagined that you were bringing, you know, a six-year-old or something. Like that. <laughs> not a yeah. six-foot, 24-year-old. <laughs> right, OK. Um, so this is the driver's seat in its normal position. So let's try, actually, just out of interest, me, Johnny. Oh, goodness. Oh, I don't even know if my feet will fit in. Hang on. Oh. Pull it forward. Okay, hang on. Ben, what I like is you've got the obligatory uh, sweet wrappers that come with every single dad car. I even cleared this out last night before. Yeah, this I came is immaculate. Today this well. car is immaculate. Okay, hang yeah, right. <laughs> I might have to take my shoes off. Um, no, hang on. No, that's fine. Let's try putting it back then. Let's see. Does the seat go forward at all? <laughs> yeah, 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 they move. They do move. <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah, cool. Hey, would it help if I put the seat up? Um, I don't know. I don't know if that's going to... Does that give you some room underneath? I don't know. Oh, hang on. Yeah, yeah. There yeah, we go. Yeah. There we go. That seat's in oh, You're in. We're cooking on gas. Okay. Right, so that's I'm, one I'm, out of four. I'm diving in. I'm getting in there. How's, how's that? Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah. Look at that. Do you remember when you could fold easily? No. No? No. I'm in. <laughs> I think that seat might need to go up. What I do like is I do like how the controls are on the side here, but when I was talking to Ben about it earlier, he did say to me... Ah, my, my toes! <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe move it forward? How do you move it forward? I think it's the, um, the bottom bit, the block, the long block. Just push it, it forward. Base, push it forward. Is that as far as, as it goes? Yeah, yeah. No. I'd lift the back up a bit. Okay, hold on. Soup. If I go sideways... How about that? Oh, there you go. Yeah. That better? Now you can do it. Yeah. There we go, look. Okay, yeah, now my feet can go on. Now put the seat back. <sighs> no, not the seat, the, the, yeah. So you, you've got long legs. How does that there, work? How do you move that seat back? All my height is in my legs. Okay, I'll do it. Wait till the crumb. Okay. That's as far forward right. as it can go. What you can Hold do on. is you can lean this forward to the point it will click. Because I do this when I put a, a rear facing baby seat behind. <laughs> so that's technically there, that's but if it. I move it, can you go back anymore? There is we that, go. That's that that's. I'm I'm in here. He's yeah. In. He's in. He's in. I'm in. <laughs> right. I don't understand what the big fuss is all about. I'm just. So, I don't see what the problem is. I fit fine. I'm extremely comfortable. Yeah. Oh gosh. Who oh. needs Who needs an SUV with the family? Yeah? Um. 
Hang on a minute. Let me come have a look at it. Uh, what's the problem? Are you stuck? Uh. Oh. Yeah, I definitely don't. Hang on. Maybe there's another way of. To... You can probably come back like a millimeter. Can you drop the front of the seat at all? The seat can drop a little bit. Or we could swap driving position. We could swap positions. Shall I see if I get in the driver's seat? Yeah, go on. Because yeah. I definitely can't get in here. Right. Ow. You <laughs> might need to move the steering wheel forward. <laughs> Yo, you bugger! <laughs> <laughs> ah, there you go. There you we go. Give me a bit more space. Um, Anthony, we appear to have the same issue. Yes. You can, you can come back a bit, James. You can move the seat back. A bit? I think I'm beyond them. Ah! Yeah, look, let me, let me, mind my hand. Oh, hang on, is that your leg? Sorry. Oh, oh I'm in! How about that? How Anthony, about that? I reckon we, if, should we swap? Hang on. I know how to do this. This is quite a bit further back than that. Yeah. I fit! There we go! <laughs> We're all in! Right. Now, how do I put the seatbelt on? <laughs> Shall we try and switch positions? <laughs> okay, help! <laughs> I'm so glad that nobody should be coming into this pub car park right now. <laughs> All right, we'll try the other way around. Ow! <sighs> How's it looking? It's... <sighs> it's not looking great. Yep, I'm gonna... <sighs> <laughs> okay, let's do this. I've shut the door! Anthony, you better get in quickly. I can do it. Oh, you so look comfy you, in you that. You've got loads of space. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yep. I can make this work. Can, this, can the steering wheel go up? Uh, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. No. Oh, it, could, it, moves, it, it moves a little bit. James doesn't look comfortable. James is not. <laughs> uh, yeah, James, you're not really doing well there, are you? No. I, I, How did you even close the door? I couldn't get my legs in. I suffered. Okay. Did you do? Did you do what any good um, special forces person would do? Just break your legs in order to make them fit? Yeah, basically. One is now longer than the other. Ah, there you go. <laughs> so <clears throat> now we have it, everybody. Definitive proof that four men will fit in an Aston Martin, but not for long. Is anybody comfortable? I'm. I'm honestly not that bad. My yep. neck is a ninety degree angle right now. So no. I think this is less of a knock on the Aston and more on the fact that you've got very long legs. Yes, yes. You know, I've got little tiny Shetland pony legs. <laughs> so that's why I'm okay back here. But yeah, anybody... Um, well. So, the good news is that for the last three years, can we all agree, I've not been lying to consumers. You've definitely been not lying to, not consumers. Lying to consumers. I think you, you've definitely got it right. Uh, to be honest though, I think I could just about drive this, but I wouldn't want to, just in case what? anything happened and that airbag went off. Uh, it, the same advice would apply for little people in this car. And right now you do actually look, given the space, like a little person, but or rather a big person actually, given the space. And then you look like a giant because your legs, look, your knees look like they're about to hit the ceiling. Yes. Mm. Um, yeah, but I'm fine, you fine? Honestly, I'm fine. I could go, if it was like me and you say, yep. and this whole compromise situation wasn't happening on over here, yep. I, could, I could sit back here for like 15 minutes and go to, you know, to the pub or something. There's one other possibility. Mm. If you went in the back. I can try. And then we could get the seat further back. Should we do it for science? Yeah. For science, for, for science. science. Right. I think we need to. For Rohan and a red dawn, ow! And quickly, because it's starting to rain, yeah. and the cameras are getting wet. <laughs> so, oh. are, you st are you coming out of the morning? Yes. I'm going to okay. try and slide this forward. So which seat am I going to go in? I think you're going to try and go... Where Damani was? Yes. Ah. I'm going to join Ben. Yes. Short leg club. The short leg club in the back, <laughs> yeah. Ow! Hold on, man. You're right. Right, now James has to figure out how to get in the back. I'm going to regret this immediately. Can we take the camera, James? So you're I'm fine. <laughs> Hi, Ben. Hey. I don't need your help. Hey. <clears throat> oh, yeah. This seat can move. Yep. This seat can move, tilt it back. Okay. And move the seat back. Actually, no. Tilt it forwards. Okay. And move the seat back because he needs the leg room. I'll tell you when. Keep going, go on. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When he screams in pain, that's definitely as far as it's going to go. Uh, yeah. Hey. Ah. I'm in. Wow. Well, <laughs> 
look at James though. Hi. How's it going? Everyone? Like you've got the exact opposite problem of Damani. <laughs> like his problem was his knees were practically hitting the yeah. ceiling, and you're basically you've I've got told your shoulders. You all I have a long torso. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Look at this. See, look, Ben and I are the same height. This is the problem. Ben and I are the same height, but like not in the back. <laughs> <laughs> right, have you got the key on you? Um, yeah, it's in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> it's in my pocket. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Anthony, you've got to close the door, otherwise it doesn't see count. See if I can get okay, oh, I'm yeah. closing the door. Okay, we're all in. Alright, I've got the key. Thanks. There we go. Now, time for your first drive with an Aston Martin. Don't go too far. No. I feel really close to you right now, James. Yeah, I'm close to you, Ben. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it springs back. Press it in. Press and hold. hold. Oh, we have to pop it back out again now. Yeah. Basically, when you and then push it all. So take it, pop it back out, and then push it all, all the way and in. Hold, hold it hard. It Don't take its nonsense. That's it. Ah, this is why they call it the emotion control unit. Yeah. Do you feel your emotion has been controlled? Yeah, I mean. I, I'm not going to get a seatbelt. Let's belt. forego seatbelt. I think we can all agree that this is dangerous enough as it is. So, uh, yeah, let's go forwards. He's trying to figure it out. That's pretty Ferrari drive. method will work as well. Don't get to turn the handbrake off. Which oh, is yeah. A fly off. It's to your right. It's to your right. Mm -hmm. It's a fly off. So lift it up. Don't push the button. Then when it's at the top, push the button in. Drop it down. You're That's good. Fair. And, uh, yeah, just take it for a lap around the car park. Oh, okay. Just what you're going to say, lap around the block then. <laughs> yeah, no, no. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, just rotate around here. Don't go onto the uh, tarmac. And also, if you could just avoid big potholes, yeah. otherwise, yeah. I mean, the good news is it'll be painless. I mean, actually, to be fair, if you do have a pot, I probably won't feel anything ever again. Yeah. There's not much movement, though, so I do feel like, you know, it's not like I can go anywhere. No, and uh, just, uh, just drop it back where we found it. Oh, right. I feel quite proud of ourselves. Uh, I don't know about you guys. I, don't, I, you don't know what? We counts. exceeded expectations. Yeah. Uh, I would not want to uh, try, if even try to get the seatbelt on. And um, right. So let's put her in park. Let's stow it. Let's make it safe. Big Pete. Big Pete. You got it. And the handbrake on. We should just pull it up. Don't press the button. That's it. And uh, who wants to do like, comment, and subscribe? I'll do it. So if you enjoyed this, please make sure you like, comment and subscribe. And if you want to see what we think about this car when there's only two adults in it, in a far less compromising position, make sure you hit the bell icon so you get notifications and get to see the next video and not miss out. Should we get another thumbnail? Yeah. <laughs>